today we are having um, uh, what we call the, the annual Western Province Blitz Festival and we've mandated Elsie's River Chess Club to host this tournament for us. That's why we're here in Elsie's River as you can see. And uh, so that means people from all walks over the peninsula, as far as Musenberg, Malkbos, Durbanville, Pontierville, Kailisha, we're all here. We, we're going to enjoy the game today and we're having what we call, like you're getting cricket, you get uh, 20 minutes, uh, what's it, 2020, the speed form of cricket. This is blitz chess, it's the speed form of chess. Chess in the Western Province is flourishing, especially at the junior scene. At the junior scene, we've got something like, uh, at, we, can have, we can host four tournaments simultaneously in the Western Province and each will be populated by at least a thousand kids. <laughs> um, I'm done telling you bad and I've been playing chess for like six years now. Um, I absolutely love Blitz. It's, it's just, it's so much fun for me because it's the adrenaline pumping of chess. I mean chess that's normal is fun but just adding that little time and that it's so much more exciting and I absolutely love it. I'm Dr. Dion Solomons. I'm the president of Chess Western Province. And what you see behind me is the 2016 Western Province Blitz Chess Championship, the team championship happening. Hi, I'm Adela Lopez. Yeah, I'm, I'm the current ESA Open Women's Champion, uh, ESA Ladies Champion, and um, I've been in the Olympia team. I'm a women's international master. I've been in the Olympia team. This was my seventh Olympia. Um, since 1998, I played for the SA national team, the ladies team, and this year we went to Baku, which was absolutely amazing, and um, I scored 7 out of 10, and I also broke uh, the current SA record for most games, consecutive games, one in a row. Yeah, so it was quite a nice experience. My name is Lyndon Bower. I am the captain of the Science Chess Club that is playing here today and uh, also captain of the national South African chess team. Uh, in, on the African continent, we are one of the top three countries that participate on the African continent. In the world, we're probably in the top 80 countries. We do have our first Grandmaster, Grandmaster Kenny Sullivan from Mitchell's Play, who stays in, in uh, Italy at the moment. But uh, in terms of South African chess, um, in, a, in our women's section, we're also in the top three competing with Algeria and Egypt uh, in those sections. So uh, internationally, we're doing okay. We can do better, and I, I believe that uh, South Africa may in the next year to get their second Grandmaster. Hello, my name is Dickens Lucas. How long have you been playing Kish? Uh, I think two years or something. Because I killed my brother, I learned coach lessons from my coach. I mean, I still go to school. I learned mistakes and then I improved on it. I like, I like to teach children to get better at the chess so then I'll teach them to be better in, at the chess and then from, when, from their own mistakes to better moves. Yeah, I travel a lot. I, I travel a lot with my family for chess and stuff. I'm going to play Western Paris in Joburg. One, two rounds. I feel great. I want to be the best junior South African chess player in the world. My vision is to be a grandmaster. Uh, my name is Denise Frick and I'm the current South African Women's Chess Champion. So I think I've been playing now for 27 years. Yes. I think chess in South Africa is growing, especially among the women players. There's a lot of young girls coming through the ranks. I think there's a lot of chess programs happening in um, previously dis disadvantaged communities. Uh, I think chess is a sport for all. Uh, it levels the, the, the playing field uh, across culture and, and um, religion and gender. So I think it's a very good sport um, for everybody to play. So in terms of development, if you can teach your child from an early age to play chess, by the time they are 13 and 14, they are so entrenched in the sport that there is actually no time to look around society and actually get interested in everything else that's because chess have captivated you by that time. So, so that's one of the aspects of 
the influence that she has on the development of the child.